Are you taking the ICT exam really soon and still struggling to find out the most effective ways to reach your design score? Don't worry, this video is for you. Here are some most helpful ICT SD exam preparation tips that should you follow accordingly, your grades can be considerably improved. The first tip is to work on your time management, and you can really improve it by following these rules. Do not study by motivation, study by discipline. Motivation only boosts your learning mood. However, with discipline, you can be able to study regardless of the conditions. Do not wait until mock exams to start study. One of the bad habits of many students is that they always wait until mock exams to start practicing and this lead to students rushing to review the topics and make sure to always revise. Don't just study for the test grade. Instead, you need to understand the topics thoroughly. In addition to learning habits, learning methods also play a key role in improving your score. The three effective learning methods are active recall, spaced repetition, and making mind map. First, we have active recall. It is the process of learning questions, test papers, flashcards. Most of us are already using this method without even realizing it. This is the most effective learning method because it forces your brain to retrieve information and form neutral network. Secondly, spaced repetition. Pretty similar to active recall, but spaced repetition is the process of doing active recall in spaced intervals. Upon utilizing this process, you'll be reviewing past knowledge by a specific spaced time span, such as a day after, a week after, a month after. This process will help in great dose of SD knowledge into the student's memory. Thirdly, making mind map. Mind mapping is also an effective strategy by drawing connected lines, finding images, and illustrating it on paper. You have already reviewed the lesson multiple times and embedded the knowledge into your memory. When it comes to IGCSE exams, studying is not enough. You have to be familiar with the exam format and know which part that requires most attention. So there are ways that you can do that. First, practice past paper. The most effective way to get good grades is to practice as many past papers as you can. You can search for them on Cambridge, at Excel, AQA website. Knowing the mark scheme. You also need to understand how the grading system of ICCSE works. Once you understand the marking scheme, you can easily determine your goals for each section and therefore establish a suitable learning schedule. After months studying and reviewing, what you do the day before exam is actually very important too. Cheat sheet. Instead, a cheat sheet would be useful. Of course, it's not a paper that you bring into exam room and cheat. A cheat sheet is a list of things that you struggle with the most. Read this before the exam instead of covering the entire book. Sleep. The final tip is to have a good sleep before exam day. Don't neglect or underestimate the power of sleep. Skipping a page or two to go to bed will surely help you score higher than you were to stay up late and grind grab night. With the above IGCSE exam preparation tips, you can confidently enter the exam room and achieve the highest possible grade. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to see more useful videos.